I'm interested in this last story. It's sort of the revolving door from government to the private sector, but really it comes at a really fascinating time when the heat around the regulatory question is arguably at its highest in the U.S. in many a year. Former CFTC Chairman Heath Tarbert is joining Circle, the USDC stablecoin issuer, as the firm's chief legal officer. A big tool, I think, in Circle's regulatory toolkit is certainly joining the squad as they push for legislation in D.C. and perhaps a fair shake on the regulatory side of the aisle. What are your thoughts on this, Jen? I'll throw it straight to you. Uh, this was something that we saw a lot of, I think, with former officials joining uh, crypto firms. That certainly tapered off as things have quieted down in the sector. This one feels notable, though. Yeah, it's feeling like if you want to survive in, in the U.S., you're going to need an ex-CFTC, ex-SEC, someone who understands how things are working behind the scenes, maybe someone who has connections at both of those agencies, someone who knows how to push the discourse forward, because like the frustrations we're hearing from you know um, leadership at Coinbase, from leadership at Kraken, from leadership at all these exchanges that are trying to operate in the U.S. is just this like real friction with regulators. So I think if you have an ex-regulator who knows how to navigate that it can be seen as beneficial. But I don't know that we've seen it be super beneficial so far, right? Like the friction still seems to to be there, but I think the strategy is is one that is the one that hopefully should work in the long term. Adam, what do you think? Yeah, I think that we can largely describe this move as don't Wells notice me, bro. Um, <laughs> again, like Circle has been kind of the most forward in terms of, hey, please regulate us. So I think that you're totally right um, in terms of like the somebody who understands. But I also think there's a really large optics piece of this, too, which is, again, there's an implication that if somebody like uh, this is joining the company, then they don't see anything wrong with it and they should know. So we come down to this like really dumb reading the tea leaves, you know, like trying to virtue signal that you're okay because you were able to hire somebody who previously worked at the regulator. In addition to really hoping that that uh, person has deep enough connections in to be like, Hey, don't, don't, you know, don't wells me, bro. Uh, Zach. Well, I got to get you on the board, but you got like five seconds. What do you think? This will keep happening. That's all I got. Atta boy. 